Welcome to the 10-Minute Treasure. My name is Jeff Pospisil, and I'm going to start a series called Odd on Purpose. Odd on Purpose, where I explore the weird things that accountants do and why they do it. So you know me or you know another accountant, and they're a little bit off, right? They, they have different tendencies, but guess what? Most of the time, there's reasons behind why they do them the way they do them. And so that's what we're going to look at. The first thing that we're going to look at is this. I carry a flip phone still. It's 2024. That's a little bit odd. Maybe you know somebody, maybe your dad, maybe your grandpa still carries a flip phone. There's not a whole lot of us that do it, but I do it for a reason. You know, partially it's because as an accountant, um, I really, I, you know, I'm not known as a people person. I like people in moderation and just the idea that people could connect with me whenever and wherever and however it was kind of, I don't know. I just didn't like the idea. So actually I was really even slow at getting a cell phone period. I thought, why would I want to pay extra? And flip phones are pretty cheap, but even that little bit extra. So that way I could be interrupted when I'm not in the office and I'm not at home. You know, I don't mind calls and everything when I'm at home and it, when I'm at the office, that was important. So for a long time, I was, yeah, I was about 30 years old before I got my first cell phone. And I stuck with the flip phone for a couple of reasons. You know, two, one reason was that while I can do some work on here, mostly it's just phone calls and some texts. So it, it can still be a distraction where work intrudes into my private life, but it's not the same as a smartphone. I would go to the um, workshops and whatever, and I would see everybody go on break. And what would they do? They would pull out their smartphone and they'd be answering email. I thought to myself, that sucks. I mean, why would I want to take a break to answer email of all things? So work became a lot easier to do through this. You can take a Zoom call. You can do all those other things through this. So you, it's harder to get away from work. Um, the, but the other thing was <laughs> on the opposite side of this, a, a smartphone can be such a huge distraction too. So whether you're at work or not, you see this all the time. People just scrolling people playing a whatever, some kind of game on their computer or watching YouTube videos or whatever else besides engaging with other people. And, you know, while this does have some distractions, I mean, I can text and I can call and those can be an intrusion or a distraction sometimes. Um, it, it's, it's at a much different level. I mean, it's not that I'm not paying so that I can mindlessly scroll. So that's those are the two main reasons. And now let me just show you a little bit more and do the limited features of this and maybe you'll consider it for yourself. All right, so here it is. Here's my flip phone. It is an LG 125 and you can see how small it is. I mean, it fits real nicely in your hand. Compare that to, this is a small smartphone. I got a smartphone just so I could deposit checks and uh, also sometimes you need like Google authentication and some stuff like that. So anyway, I got it and it's not actually hooked up to any plan or anything. I just bought it for cheap so I can deposit checks. But here's this one. The one thing, so I got this one about three years ago. And one thing that's kind of annoying is this little display right here. Normally that used to light up and tell you the time or tell you who's calling and that died a few months ago so i'm kind of sad about that all right so here it is when it's opened up um it, you know one of the big things is the time that's one of the main things you want to see I, it is good for texting i do short text it's that t9 test texting so for example if i want to write my name it's five three, three, three. And if, if I wanted to actually do something different, you hit the next button right down there. So some of you that never had, um, T9 texting, it's not, it's not the worst thing, but it is a little bit slow. I also have some of my favorites on here. So there are different apps if you want to call it. So I got like a calculator and a stopwatch and a timer. So stopwatch, we're doing track. So that's kind of nice to have that. And like I said, there's a calculator and an alarm. You can do email technically. 
So if I go down to email, there is email and it will it's connected to my Gmail, so I could technically do it, but it is a pain. Also, I can go out to the internet and the main thing I go out to the internet for is actually sports scores. So I just keep these tabs open. I have like three tabs. I have the scores and then the Bible and you know, many of the different functions don't actually work that well, but um, this is the common, so you can see it's really small, but it is, it is doable in a pinch. But the main thing you're doing here is making calls. The battery life lasts a long time. I charge this maybe. All right. That brings us to the end. I will put a link to an article. There was an article some time ago about why the younger generation is going to a dumb phone or a flip phone. And maybe it'll convince you to be weird as well. All right. Till next time. God bless.